so hello everyone welcome back now let us start the new unit that is chapter number 5 magnetostatics so uh, in this unit we are going to study magnetic fields and we are going to study how a test charge when placed in a magnetic field react and what are the what are its different parts so before going to the example number 5.1 that you can see in the screen let us uh, i i recommend you to uh, study the theory behind this that is on page number 212 13 and even 14 2 and the formula is very important that f magnetic magnetic field is equal to force in the magnetic field is q v cross b and the formula we will be using here also so the formula says uh, the question says that we have to study a cyclotron motion and we have to uh, study how a cyclotron behaves so for a cyclotron it is saying that we have a r typical motion of a charged particle in a magnetic field is circular so we will draw a circular all right circular plane and it is a xy plane all right so i'll be using the xy plane so it is a xy plane XY. all right so uh, the charge is moving in tangential direction with a velocity v and the force is at as you can see here it is given uh, it is uh, providing the centripetal acceleration the centripetal force acts towards the center and uh, by the right hand thumb rule we can also say that fbi you you very well know that that we can calculate the direction of magnetic field that if force is pointing towards uh, 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 towards the center and uh, charge is going uh, tangentially then the b will act inside inside the uh, page or inside your screen you can see all right so magnetic field points into the page or or or, or the screen so uh, as you know that force magnetic uh, force is given as q v cross b you very well know that and that force will provide the charge test charge the centripetal uh, force so mv square by r or you can say that m into a by the newton's equation and where a is a tangential acceleration where uh, tangential acceleration formula is v square by r so you can get it by that way or the by the centripetal force way so q v cross b and v cross b is v, v b sin theta the angle between magnetic field and uh, the velocity is 90 degree here because it is inside the plane uh, page or the screen and the v is uh, just a tangential so theta is 90 degree here that is why if we put 90 degree here we get mv square by r and 90 degree q v p is equal to mv square by r so v v cancelled out cancelled out so we get q r into b is equal to p so this is the formula for cyclotron motion if a uh, uh, particle is moving in a cyclotron then he'll be using this formula so uh, that is all for this video see you in next video bye bye